Hello everybody, Jay Luca here. Today we are opening up an Evolving Powers Premium Collection box. You guys might see something, uh, see something funny about this. It's the fact that uh, the cards in it are all upside down. That's the proper way, or the cardboard, whatever way you want to say it. We'll see it. But uh, yeah, let's open this up. Uh, this is an error box, so hopefully, um, hopefully this has some good hits. I believe it has... What looks like three Obsidian Flames, two Paldea Evolves, and then two Sword and Shield sets. I think one of them's Ash Radiance and the other one's Lost Origin. But uh, let's get this open. There's the front and there's the back. So you do get quite a few car uh, uh, stuff, quite a lot of stuff in this. Um, but I mean, the promo foil cards are pretty cool. So uh, let's get this open. Let's see, hopefully, hopefully we can get some uh, good pulls. Open this up. Alrighty. Alrighty. So, yes, it is two Astral Radiances. I was in I thought it was a Lost Origin as well. So, you got three Obsidian. And then two Paldea. And then two Astral. So, I'll go... And then, V-Star Marker. Oh, wow. I didn't even realize. This box has have promos on the other side of them as well. I did not realize that. Um, how do I want to get this open? So, let's, let's see. I think I want to keep these separate because these will probably be box exclusives. So, I got a... We got a... Kellia and Ralts, and then a Magneton and Magnemite. So uh, I'll just keep those. I don't know if they deserve a sleeve, but these certainly do. I don't know how I'm going to get these out without damaging them all. Oh my goodness, I think I'm just going to have to... Yep, and they go everywhere. Alrighty. <laughs> so I've got a Magnezone V. If I can put the camera down a little bit. we got a Magnezone V. Pretty standard V, nothing really too special. Um, but I mean, I guess it's a promo, and it doesn't say that it is a promo as well. So I guess um, I don't know if this is like an alternate artwork to a V to the V card. Um, in I believe Astral Radiance, this can go on the sleeve. But I mean, yeah, if you ever wanted this card but you couldn't pack it, I guess here's the time for you to pick one up. There's the Magnezone. And the V star. Pretty nice. Pretty all, all pretty standard. So, you know, nothing crazy. I mean, the box was really expensive. Got a Gardevoir V. Um, yeah, it was it was crazy expensive for uh, seven packs. I guess I don't know if it's because of all the promo cards or what, but yeah, crazy expensive. Um, there's a Gardevoir EX. And then, actually, this is my favorite card out of all of them, is the VMAX. That looks pretty nice. This is probably my favorite one out of them. It says a little D down there. Nice. All right, let's do this. Let's hope, hopefully, hopefully we can get some good stuff. I haven't opened up um, Sword and Shield packs in quite a while, so, you know. Can we get something good out of our two Astrals? Can we get, I believe... Ooh, that'd be... It'd be crazy if we get the, um... Oh, the, the Machamps in this. The Machamp V alternate art. That would be cool. Any alternate art would be pretty cool. Alrighty. We have a Darkness Energy. We've got a Heavy Ball. Come on. Let's see something out of the old Sword and Shield battle. Well, not really old. We got a Hisuian Sneezler and a non hollow. Alrighty. Next pack, hopefully. Better luck. Hopefully, something good. One, two, three, four. Alrighty, we got a Leaf Energy. We have a Psyduck, 
Togepi, we got a Magnemite, Rolts, we got a Village, <laughs> some type of Village, and a Reggie Rock non holo. Honestly, not surprising that we didn't get anything really in the two Sword and Shield packs. But you know what? These two Paldea Evolve packs, come on, let's see something. I always love opening up Paldea Evolves. If you guys are subscribed to the channel and you watch my videos a lot, you guys know I open up so much Paldea Evolve. So let's see what we get. We got a Sandy Ghast and a Spirit Tomb. Damn. Go on. Next pack. Come on, there's got to be something in here. The heats have to start heating up. Maybe they'll start heating up. Uh, the hits will start heating up in the Obsidian Flames packs. I I wouldn't mind the Alt Charizard or another Iono out of this pack. Alrighty. Looks like it's going to have to start heating up in Obsidian Flames because we've gotten nothing. Four packs opened. Come on, Obsidian Flames. I'll save the Charizard to last. This has to... I've got to get a good card in every single one of these. Or at least one massive hitter. Maybe an alt art would do it. Probably the Charizard. Any of the Charizards would be pretty good. We have a Lechonk. Cubchu. And a Kareden EX. I swear, this is the only hitter card we get. I'm going to be very disappointed. Kareden EX. Alrighty, come on. We got a Pidgey, Combi, Varum, we got a Lavatar, Bronzong, Beartick, Lechonk, Togekiss, and a Dragonite EX. Come on. We have to get something good out of this last pack. Are the two EX, see, I mean, Obsidian Flames is heating up, but it's only about lukewarm. Come on. Come on. Something good out of this. We got a Numel. We have a Blossom. Darmanitan. Is this a sign? Is this a sign? Heatmore. Fuck. <laughs> Dark Rhino. You know what? I'll... I will. <laughs> Far out. Come on. I will, I will sleep the Diamantan. If you know, you know. <laughs> if you know, you know. But I'm sleeping the Diamantan. We got two EXs. This box, I'm going to say it now. I think this box has been out for a while, but certainly not worth getting, like, at all. Um, definitely a no-go. I reckon it's, you know, not very good at all. But, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Jay Licky out.